I don't know if you have ever encountered these situations. As the desktop PC has too many peripherals connected, it's full of all kinds of dongles or input or output devices. Then you have another laptop that also requires those peripherals. Maybe you're like me, not having either two desks or the second peripheral set. So the solution in the past was to unplug all of them or reconnect them with the laptop or the laptop's docking station. Then I just trapped myself in a messy cables every time I wanted to switch the devices between two PCs. And meanwhile, your phone is in low battery, but you are too frustrated to look for the charger. So again, you unplug something and then connect the phone to your computer. But the charging efficiency turns out to be very low. That's the old fact that we've been through. Before we start seriously searching for useful docking stations for organizing your desktops, these situations used to happen almost every day. And we found out that they are just the reason making our work exhausting. A couple of weeks ago, I found another creative compact docking station that could easily fix the problems I mentioned, which is the Anchor KVM Switch Duo 4K for desktop and laptop. Let's check out how it works like magic. While the Anchor KVM switch is packed in pure white with a blue Anchor logo printed on the upper left corner, when you open the package, you can see quite a lot of accessories. A USB-A to C cable, an HDMI cable, a DisplayPort cable, a full function USB-C cable, a 100W adapter, an AC cord, and a user guide. That's pretty much something that we've never seen in other docking stations. It adopts a gradual color design of silver. The bright silver in the middle gradually diffuses to both sides into dark gray. The white anchor logo is printed in the middle. Ports and the power button are distributed at the front and back side of the station. And the cable on the right is connected with black stuff with the gray edges. And there's a round button on it. What exactly is this function? Please let me leave it in the suspension here. As a docking station, the anchor KVM switch is not large in size and weighs only 254 grams but it has a total of 11 interfaces. That's pretty impressive. Later, we will show you how they work together. The dock has no built-in battery, so a power adapter is required. The included 100W adapter is perfectly capable of doing all the work of its ports, especially when we learn the USB-C port for connecting the laptop can also offer fast PD charging. You may have noticed this mysterious button. Before introducing this function, let me briefly explain what KVM is. In simple terms, a KVM switch allows you to switch between different computer sources while not just using the same monitors, but also all the connected devices like keyboards, mice, and audio devices. You don't have to buy separate monitors, keyboards, and mice for every single PC. Instead, just buy one of each and use the switch to go from PC1 to PC2. Although there are many mice and keyboards that also have multi-device switching functions, after all, they need to be switched separately, and the process is somewhat cumbersome. In contrast, the KVM function of this docking station can save users a lot of effort. If you're a freelance worker and you have two PCs, one for work and the other for entertainment, imagine that after you have it, when you want to relax after work, you don't need to spend extra time unplugging and reconnecting. Just press the button and you can enter the game immediately. There are two indicators on the switch, PC1 and PC2. The blue indicates that PC1 is working, and the yellow one tells PC2 is working. In our test, the Anchor KVM switch could smoothly switch between a desktop and another laptop, and everything could stay online. If you think the button is too cluttered on the desk, don't worry, the magnetic remote button is designed to allow you to attach to any metal. And the area is particularly divided by different colors, which is a smart detail that conveniently helps users distinguish between PC1 and PC2, and also between video signals input and output. As mentioned, the USB-C port with 65W output here can be used to connect to some laptop or even an iPad or Steam Deck with PD power supply. 
The dark gold area has a total of three ports, an HDMI in, a DP in, and another USB-C. Based on the icon above, you can see that this area is recommended to connect a desktop PC, and the silver area at the far left has another output combo of HDMI and PD, which is left for connecting dual monitors. It means that both the laptop and desktop can stand by while connecting up to two monitors, and with a single click on the mysterious button here, you will be able to switch the display source between PC1 and PC2 more easily than ever before. It's very friendly to users who need to expand the display, and as a media worker, such design truly surprises me, though I did imagine something like it before. Not only that, the HDMI and DP output support up to 60Hz 4K display under the Windows system, and in the Mac system, the dual setup still works, but the highest refresh rate will be reduced to 30Hz. The Anchor KVM switch has a total of 4 USB ports, 3 of which can support up to 5 GPS data transfer. They are mainly used to connect the peripherals, external storage devices, or to charge mobile devices. The USB-C interface on the far left also supports a fast charge of up to 20 watt power. Especially for iPhones, the charging power has already made us forget about the most regular charging bricks. The two USB-A interfaces in the middle that support up to 5 Gbps transfer speeds can greatly reduce the file transfer speed. The USB-A 2.0 port on the far left is slower, but dongle, which connects some peripherals, is a good choice. The Anchor KVM switch has a separate audio in or out port on the left side, which can be used to connect to the headset or stereo, truly connecting all devices with the docking station. In conclusion, in the course of receiving the Anchor KVM switch and doing some testing on it, it really demonstrated the power of being a premium docking station, and the addition of KVM functionality was not only impressive, it also offers a new possibility for people who use dual computers for work and entertainment. Just bring more possibility to your workstation. It really works. Alright, I'm Wei Feng from China. Thank you for watching. See you next time.